the final score of 115-86 doesn't show it, but there was a moment in Game 6 where the Warriors appeared to be in legitimate danger. Rockets were rolling, James Harden was scoring and Golden State couldn't stop anything. At halftime, Houston led by 10 points thanks to 11 makes from 3-point range. The Warriors only had 4. The second half flipped the script. Golden State moved away from the Kevin Durant isolation sets and put the ball back into the hands of Stephen Curry. The result was a product that people have expected of the Warriors for quite some time, three-point shooting, and a relentless attack that eventually overwhelms their opponent. Golden State finished with 16 makes from deep. Despite James Harden having 32 points, the Rockets just couldn't do enough to slow down Curry's 29 points and Thompson's 35 points. The Splash Bros came through in a big way in the second half and now both teams will head back to Houston for a winner-takes-all Game 7, Game 6, Warriors 115, Rockets 86 James Harden finally broke his streak of three-point misses in Game 6. Going back to Game 4, Harden had 22 straight missed three-pointers. It took him three tries on Saturday night before he finally hit one, and you could tell from his reaction that he was just happy to finally have one go down. After a rough start to the game it looked like the Rockets might run away with Game 6. The Warriors were struggling to hit shots and Houston was running the floor with no problems. Then, Kevin Durant decided he was sick of that. Durant followed up his block with a sick crossover on Harden followed by a bounce pass for an easy two points. This was the exact response the Warriors were looking for. In the second half, the Warriors came out and started draining shots from three-point range. Stephen Curry and Klay Thompson sent a reminder to everybody on why they're called the Splash Brothers, however, James Harden got his step-back game going and started to cook a little. Warriors can try to slow him down as much as possible, but if he's hitting these shots then there's just nothing a defense can do about it. In the fourth quarter, Mike D'Antoni tried to spare some rest for James Harden. The results were not ideal for the Rockets. Curry and Thompson continued their assault on the Rockets' defense and before you could blink the game was pretty much over. The Warriors ran away with it and forced a Game 7. NBA Playoffs 2018 Bracket Igor Mello, CBS Sports Live blog coverage If you are unable to view the application below, please click here.